literally, there was no delay, it just fired up and it was like a, a, a small buzzing sound and you can now just see it awaiting uh, clearance in the background. Now, uh, Didier Esten, of course, he's not just the pilot, he is the chief designer, he is the inspiration behind this aircraft. In fact, the E-Fan that you see here today, the demonstrator, is his eighth design of aircraft. And he is just preparing himself to go more into wind, to come back this way and take off in a northerly direction. The runway here is actually in a north-south direction. And it may be one of those uh, interesting statistics or facts that actually people think, of course, that the UK is north of France. But actually, flying from Lyd to uh, Calais is in a due yeah, east yeah. direction. But I don't know if people actually know what the history of the prize uh, and, uh, and Blerio was, but in uh, 1908, the Daily Mail a UK national paper uh, offered a prize of £500 to anybody that could cross the channel. In fact, this was seen as a remarkably dangerous undertaking, such that even the famed Wright brothers... Oh, and here he is in the background. He's actually coming past us right now. This is history in the making as we have the E-Fan taking off, gliding silently. Uh, engine of the batteries and that's really what he needs to monitor um, that's what you need to monitor in an electric plane so that's the main innovation of the plane uh, the battery engine and that's what you need to keep a close eye on during the flight <laughs> 